Don't forget to put in your closed captions to get the full scoop. Enjoy! So they tie up the legs so it won't kick. Just in case, just a precaution. It might be even playful, but if it kicks you, it uh, kind of hurts. Uh, good luck. This is the first, so I don't even know what to do. So, uh, <laughs> it's going to be exciting. Okay, so this is the first time for me. I have absolutely no clue what we're going to do or how we're going to do it. I mean, so uh, oh, good luck. Pretty cool. <laughs> because it isn't so easy to see for the uh, thing. Sí. Y apretamos. Bien. A ver, bien. Sí. Ya para la primera vez. Excelente. Well, it goes very well, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, Excelente. Excelente. Okay. So this is how you do it. Contratado. Contratado. ¿Y cuántos litros al día saca de cada vaca? Eh, 10, 12. 12 litros por medio. 10 to 12 litros por cow por día. Es que es un poco más entusiasta. Ay. Puedes sentir que el otro es caliente. And of course the milk too. This is quite fun actually. It's a little tiresome, but pretty cool. So you can actually drink it like this. He just said you can put some uh, chocolate powder in there and have some nice chocolate milk. Okay, so it's time for me now to milk the cow. I did it once in my life and it didn't run well because there's, you have to, well you did it actually very good. So. Oh, that's warm, actually. Yeah. Okay. There you yeah. go. Yeah. Bien. 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 Oh. Excelente. So, over here they milk the cows. Then it will be picked up. And somebody else is going to make proper milk of it. Cheese, sour cream. And then the whole community just help each other uh, this way. So. So normally they leave one tit on milk. So when the cow goes out, the calf has something to drink. And the reason the calf hits his head against the other is to get the milk down. So it looks kind of aggressive, but it's basically to enable him to drink. So he's losing up the milk right now. Make my job a bit easier. It's kind of tiresome after uh, a little while. Of course, I guess if you do this every day, you're kind of used to it. For me to milk 12 liters, 
Out of all those cows, I'll be here all day. This is the one over there is a male. They have no horns, though. They prefer them to have no horns because, of course, they hurt the other cows and also the others. So they make sure that they don't. Pero usted hace como para que no crezcan, ¿no? Para que no crezcan. So they make sure that the horns don't come out, um, so they don't hurt each other and the mother. ¿Cuántas roscas tiene? Dos. No, cuente bien desde desde la orilla. Ah, tres. Ah. If you see the horns, there's like three circles. Each circle stands for a birth. So you can see how many births they have given by the circle on the horn. Yeah, you. That's rather interesting. Cool. Now is that your favorite? Well, funny enough, I've never been so close to any cow ever. And that's me coming from Holland. So yeah, it's kind of cool. So what he just explained to me is that the calves, they'll drink from the mother and then they'll get it every other day. They take it away little by little, so one day they get the milk, one day they don't. One day they get the milk, one day they don't. So they step by step over a month, they get used not to drink milk from the mother anymore. But if they do that right away, it will be going like all day long, it will be complaining. Fun fact. So you might think this cow is skinny, but it's actually the type of cow they all look like that. Completely different than the cows back in Holland, but it's nice. Leche con agua. <laughs> I don't know why, but we're going to see it. We're going this way. You don't know what we're going to do? No, I don't. I really don't. Very surprised it is. I think something to do with this one. Oh, oh, that's a big one. Hi. Oh, he's not a big one. Oh. <laughs> he's not friendly either. Hello. He didn't have his coffee this morning. Good morning to you too. Oh, thank you. So I just asked Brian, um, what do you prefer when the calf comes out? It to be female or male? It actually depends on the breed because some cows are better for milking and some cows are better for eating. So for example, this one, if the cows of this breed are too old to get milked, they're still good to eat. The other ones, they're not really tasteful for food, so they're not really sold that expensive. So it really depends on the breed whether you prefer to have cows or bulls. Interesting fun fact. So we went from feeding chickens to milking cows. It's getting more local and more rural every step of the way. We might end up buying a farm in Costa Rica. They like this. They're enjoying this. Oh, they all want the same treatment. Oh, full house. <laughs> So I pick you up this afternoon then? Yeah, I'll be cuddling cows all day. Okay. Ya van para Sí. Okay. Vamos, te ping. So the big cows are over there at the water. They're gonna stay there and eat. And they'll go to a different place every day. The small ones are staying here because they're too small, too young to go out in the field yet. So they keep them here all day to eat, and uh, tomorrow is another day. What a life! <laughs>